Dear students, I welcome you all to this problem solution series in digital electronics. I am solving the problems from the book Digital Design by Maurice Mano and Michael Sileti. So in this video, I am solving the problem number 2.16 from chapter number 2. The problem is the logical sum of mean terms of a boolean function of n variables is 1. So we are given with a statement here that the logical sum of the mean terms that is sum of product then the first part of the question is prove the previous statement for n equal to 3 so for n equal to 3 we have to prove this statement then the part b of the problem is suggest the procedure for a general proof so we have to then write the steps or the procedure for this proof now first solve for a here we are given that n equal to 3 and we have to prove that sum of m i equal to 1 where i equal to 3. Let input variables are a, b and c because we are given that we have to consider 3 variables. Okay. So function of a comma b comma c equal to because we have three input variables we will have eight combinations okay so we'll get a bar b bar c bar plus a bar b bar c plus a bar b c bar plus a bar b c plus a b bar c bar plus a b bar c plus a b c bar plus a b c for this first four terms we can take a bar common so we'll get b bar c bar plus b bar c plus b c bar plus b c okay and for the last four terms we'll get a bar common and we'll get b bar c bar plus b bar c plus b c bar plus b c a bar plus a all into this term b bar c bar plus b bar c plus b c bar plus b c okay so this term is nothing but one so we can write it as b bar c bar plus b bar c plus b c bar plus bc okay now here also we can take from the first two term we can take b bar common we'll get c bar plus c plus b common c bar plus c so we can rewrite it as b bar plus b because we can take these two term common okay and we'll get c bar plus c so from here we can see that this both these terms are one so answer will be 1. So the first part of the problem is done. That is we have proved the statement for n equal to 3. Now we have to do the second part of the problem. Now we have to write this procedure. How we have found this. We have n number of terms. So we can write it as f of x1, x2, xn. Because we have n input variables. Sum of m, i. So this sum of mi will have 2 to the power n number of terms. Therefore sum of mi will have 2 to the power because n input variables 2 to the power n number of terms. So from here we can see that half of the terms have a bar common that is first term common and a complement of the first term that is a okay it is common so here we can write it as step one will be after writing the sum of mean terms form what we can do the sum of m i has 2 to the power n by 2 mean terms with x1 that is the first term in the previous case we have found it to be a okay here it will be x1 and 2 to the power n by 2 mean terms will have x1 bar x1 bar 
Second part of the problem is which can be factored and removed because we have seen in the previous case that we have factorized this one and this a and a bar is removed okay now we'll have 2 to the power n minus 1 term because here we have 4 terms that means 2 square 2 square means 2 to the power 3 minus 1 terms okay so next part we can write the remaining 2 to the power n minus 1 terms will have 2 to the power n minus 1 by 2 terms with x2 and 2 to the power n minus 1 by 2 mean terms will have x2 thus common which can be factored and removed okay because we have after this finding this 2 to the power n minus 1 term here in this case 2 to the power 3 minus 1 is 2 to 2 square is 4 number of terms so third step is continue this process and continue this process until the last term is left and xn plus xn bar will be 1 because in the last term we got b plus bb bar plus b is 1 alternatively by induction the function f can be rewritten as f equal to for the last term we can write it as f equal to xn z plus xn bar z with z equal to 1 therefore f equal to xn plus xn bar z equal to 1 so this is the solution of the second part of the problem so thank you for watching if you have any question please put it in the comment section below also like share and subscribe to my channel thank you